Dear students, we will study now development tools. In this topic, we are going to be discussing the mobile development tools, showing you how to hook up the development tools to your mobile browser, the Chrome developer tools, which enable you to analyze and debug your web applications. Now you may already be familiar with the development tools but what's really exciting about them is that you can now easily use these tools for your mobile debugging. Let's get started. On any web page like www.vu.edu.pk you can open the connection developer tools in the Google Chrome by clicking on the shortcut listed in tools developer tools. Now technically speaking you don't need a mobile device in order to take this course or even to test out most of what you will learn. But you are missing a lot of the experience of mobile web development without a device, preferably at least one Android device. You can use Chrome's great mobile debugging tools which we will be using in this course. But the more devices you have and the more variety the better. A traditional website is accessed via computer with help from a mouse and a large screen. A mobile website on the other hand is accessed via smartphone or tablet with a smaller screen and touch screen navigation. Chrome development tools provides a series of tabs that allow you to debug and inspect your web apps. For example, you can select any element on the page by right clicking the element and selecting inspect element. Or as I will do here, you can click on the magnifying glass and hover over the area that you would like to inspect. Let's change the text in one of the float selectors. We can do that by simply expanding the element that contains it and then editing it live on the page. You can see all these things in the snapshot. You can also make live edits to the CSS. CSS is actually the coded style sheets. Let's take a look at changing the selected floor class. Here I can set the background color to whatever I want. For example, blanched almond because who does not like blanched almonds because the background color is now pretty light. We may also want to change the text color. Chrome Depth Tools provides a handy color picker for that. We can pick any color we want. Shift plus clicking the color picker allows you to cycle through the different color schemes RGB, HSL and so on. If we scroll a little bit further so our float selector class we can play around with the different settings there. You can use the scroll wheel to cycle through the different sizes and we can set the border width in a similar fashion. As you can see Chrome development tools provides with rich functionality to edit and inspect your pages and then was just one tab we will be de diving deeper into the network timeline and profile tabs. Dear students, this is the web page of Virtual University of Pakistan. V now we check how we can see the development tools here. Let's click on here. We right clicked and then click inspect element. You will see now your page has been divided into three windows. One is the your web page. The other contains some other more tabs like elements, console, sources, network, timeline, profiles. and resources security audits the third one the third one contains html body and and all other tags are related information about the html and css 